Lizzie World, Lizzie Gang. I'm doing a reaction today, a live life. She found her husband with a girlfriend, new girlfriend. Thought I would be in such a ratchet ass mm -hmm. situation. It's okay, girl. It's okay. It's okay. Oh my gosh. Oh shit. Breathe. Oh, I guess Calm I down. My seatbelt off, right? I'm still sitting here with my motherfucking seatbelt on. Calm down. It's okay. Oh my, my gosh. gosh. Like, and I don't even want to cry. My heart is just You don't have so to bad. cry. And I know. My you don't have to cry. Crazy. I got my lips done today. They bruised and they bruised. You don't even need that done. Girl, don't, you don't look pretty anyway. But... <sighs> you guys, I'm going to just be 100% because mm -hmm. I'm always 100% with everything. I, Gerard and I have broken up. Okay. Mm -hmm. Okay. No. <laughs> We have stopped fucking with each other, mm -hmm. but broken up, mm -hmm. I don't even, the lines are so blurry at this point. I don't even know. I don't even know anymore. We've been having sex. Of course, we've been having sex. He's my husband. Mm -hmm. I can't. So my kids can be around their father. Mm-hmm. Oh my God, Gerard has been talking to a female ever since before he left me. Oh. <laughs> he probably was talking for he probably was talking to her for a while. So much, and I'm sure you guys are like, oh, before he got with you, care? probably. Why are you worried about it? He's done so much, and I I understand that. I completely 100. He he has done so much to me, and. I always tell him, the way you've done me, I should never fuck with you ever again. How dirty you've done me. I'm in mean, your mommy country, y'all. Like, and I hate that I love Thank you for Jesus. subscribing to my channel. I'm not here to bash nobody. I'm doing a reaction video you know, on my page, my on. platform. From study breakers to midnight gamers him and I always tell him now I tell him I hate him because mm -hmm. my love has slowly turned into hate girl he slept at my house tonight and bitch I got on his motherfucking phone pull the receipt out girl pull it out girl tell me why he's in a whole motherfucking relationship with a bitch named oh, she probably Lord, know you do you see probably myself. I just watched this and I'm reacting I to it, y'all. I can't make this shit up. He's in a whole fucking relationship with this bitch. We ain't and gonna say no bitch on. Hi, baby. Don't Hi, say no baby. bitch. Yeah, our man. This is our man. It's my husband, but it's your boyfriend. My motherfucking husband has a girlfriend, bro. I never thought I would be in such a ratchet ass situation. Like we've been Did you call so much, but for him to take it this far. Mm-hmm. And no, it's not like he left Florida and was like, I'm done with you. It's over. This nigga has always been like hanging me on like a like a a thread. Like a string. Like, I don't wanna divorce you. I love you. But he's whole ass telling this bitch that he loves her. <sighs> you guys, I don't think I'm gonna upload this video. I just need this. I just needed to vent. I'm, it's 4 in the morning. It's 4.15 in the morning. I've called this bitch. I left her a message. I don't do this. I don't do this. I think he lives with the bitch, too. I think he Because she's talking about come home. Ooh. Girl, I'm reading all these text messages. And I don't even know if she knows that he's married. He probably won't marry her next, to. probably. She, if mm. she knows I have a YouTube channel. He probably rocked you. wedding video. She probably been watching you. How can you desperate ass bitches fuck with married men? I don't care how. Okay, girl, you desperate as fuck. I understand. I get it. And yeah, she's cute. I'm going to give you that. You're a cute girl. I don't think you have any kids. My body. All you need Went to do is to my husband's out of work. Honestly. 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 My husband's out of work. Honestly.
My husband got a girlfriend. Bye bye, deuces. Girl, I'm ducked off. I'm ducked off, girl. This is like, I can't make this shit up. I cannot make this shit up. I literally, we had sex. We sure did. He's my husband, you guys. I'm sorry. I know that's weak of me, and I know that's pathetic that I've allowed him to treat me so wrong, and I still go back to him. That I know it's pathetic. Now move forward. Wait. You guys can talk. Talk shit all you want. That's fine. But it's like, this man has the, has been the only man that's done this shit to me. Like, done me so I'm dirty. I'm gonna need Doritos. Don't mind me. he's telling this bitch he loves her. <sighs> but if he loves her, why is he fucking coming over at my house? He probably girl, told her that he like gotta work over properly. Like, girl. Oh, my lord. He, oh. Oh my goodness. He fell asleep. And I know Gerard. I always fucking tell him this. I know him like the back of my fucking hand. I know him. I've been with him for so long. So I'm sorry, Antifisha. Antifisha, whatever the fuck your name is, bitch. That's my motherfucking nigga, bitch. I've been with this man since I was 20. Girls, almost eight. It's gonna be. Oh my god. I just thought about this shit. It's October 4th. Our anniversary is tomorrow. It will be eight years tomorrow. He fell asleep. Like I said, I know his ass. Mm-hmm. He was knocked the fuck out. So I took his phone. Can't nobody do it like I do. My deal. And I was trying to. First of all, he has his fucking phone on silent. So I was looking for it, and it was in, in his hand talking. I already know what he's been doing. I already know he's been doing some dirty ass shit. Because I know. I know him. So, mm-hmm. but I just need to find out. I need to know. I need to know what he's doing. You know that womanly feeling like, bitch, we just need to know? Yeah. I just needed to know. For sure. Because I've been hearing shit all over the place. I already knew he was fucking with a bitch. But saying, I love you living live in with a bitch he's been telling me he's been at his granny's house bitch but obviously he's been telling you the same thing <sighs> he fell asleep he was knocked the fuck out i was trying to think of any code bitch i even put the you know he got the uh face recognition thing girl i did that it wouldn't because he was knocked out <sighs> tell me why i put my birthday he got my motherfucking birthday as his Passcode. Mm. He has my birthday as my passcode. Mm-hmm. Bitch, I was like, oh, when I got that mother, when I got in that bitch, I grabbed my purse, I grabbed my phone, I grabbed his phone, bitch, and I ran. Bitch, I was out. And now I'm sitting in my car. <laughs> oh my God. And he's been talking to this bitch since July. And this was the bitch he was fucking with before we got married, before he came to Florida. Hmm. This is just, this is so sad. This is so pathetic. And he's, <sighs> my thing is, if you're going to move on, nigga, move the fuck on. Give me my divorce and keep that fucking same energy. That's the same shit I've been telling him. Keep that same energy. Remember, I came out here for my kids. I don't care what nobody says or what nobody thinks. When he left, that broke my kid's heart. And I was like, you know what? Now, mm-hmm. aside from the house situation, the house situation is a whole nother situation. Everything just so happened to happen at the same time where I left that house. I was able to get out that house, get get my money back for that house and everything, which I may have, I'll probably have a separate video on, but I was like, fuck it. Like, when I got out that house, I was like, I'll just go. When we started Carvana, they told show. us that selling cars 100% online wouldn't work. But we went to work, building an experience right. that lets me. But I'll start my life. He has his own life. I have my own life. Thinking that, you know, he's trying to do the same thing I'm trying to do. Heal, 
you know, find myself, get my life together. But this man gets in a whole nother relationship. Telling this bitch that he loves her. Can we say he's a bitch? They're here looking at fucking apartments and houses and shit. Oh my god. But yeah, he has a wife and three kids. And I know what he's done in Florida. I know what he did. It was very fucked up what he did. It was unexcusable, disgusting. But love is a motherfucking thing, man. Mm. At this point, love is the worst feeling in the world. Love from a man like this. This is how crazy this this nigga is. He has my birthday as his damn lock screen. Okay? I went through his photos. He has no photos of this bitch in his phone other than in the text messages. And Mm. he has all of our photos. He has all the kids' photos, all my photos, all our photos. That's crazy. That's like living a double life. And you guys, I have been strong. Like for the past week, I've only been this for a couple weeks. I'm not going to lie. The first week was hard as hell because I was like stupidly like we can we can try. Like maybe we can go to counseling. We've never been to counseling. We can go to counseling. Well, we've been to counseling before, but we didn't go like we should have. You know, we could get in the church like we could try after all, we're married. <sighs> but, you know, Brief. he wasn't trying to have that. He wasn't trying to have any of that. So I cut him off. I was like, okay, well, fine. I, I finally got it. You know, I got it through my head that he doesn't want to be with me. And he's living his own life. So, girl, I cut him off. Mm-hmm. And I was done. I was good for a whole fucking week. I didn't text him. I didn't call him. I didn't bother him. But, like, guess who just shows up to my house and lovey dubby and let's make it work and nope I don't even answer the door what if everyone gave you the value that the general does but you have a whole bitch you have a whole girl that you're living with and you're Mm -hmm. over here telling you love me you want to start over we can he's basically saying everything that I was saying when I first got here Girl, he's been on my house all weekend. He's been on my house all weekend. Put him out. Put him out. And she's over here. Jerry, you need to call me. Did she call? Jerry, um, so you're basically not coming home two nights in a row. Bitch, he's married, you dumbass. And he got kids, you stupid ass. <laughs> Maybe he didn't tell her that you that he was married. Other places, like he's not a hundred percent for you, baby, because he's of course attached to his wife that he's still married to and his three fucking kids, bitch. Oh, girl, these bitches these days kill me. I I wish I would be single, no man, no kids, and be falling for a fucking married man. I know I'm dumb, but I ain't that fucking dumb. That's some next level desperado type shit. Like, I can I can never. But I'm going to give her the benefit of the doubt, and I'm going to say she doesn't know the whole story, obviously. She probably don't. But still, you know he's married. It, it's completely his fault. This is 100,000% mm-hmm. his fault. Like, he's playing her. He's playing me. Wow. This is crazy. He got my-